Welcome to the Tech Me Show. Uh, today I'm going to be teaching you how to take your Windows Phone 7 uh, application and install it on your phone. Now, easily you could do this in Visual Studio, sure. But we're going outside the box, people. This is exciting. Look alive. So now we can choose device or emulator. We're going to go ahead and choose the device. We'll go ahead and select browse. And browse to wherever the source is to your... Uh, program. For instance, I'm going to install IT Guy instead of uh, uh, one of my other ones, for instance. So I'll go ahead and double click it or click it uh, and cl click open and press deploy. Oh no, what is that? I don't have Zune open. Well, if you saw one of my other tutorials, I teach you how to get around this. And since we're going so uh, rogue, for instance, um, I'm going to teach you how to get around this without ever having to load Zune. Okay? So, let's go ahead and open up uh, your command prompt. I made a shortcut to make this video easier for us. Go ahead and go to your main C drive. And now let's go ahead and go to C program files. Since I'm on 64-bit, I need to choose the x86 uh, folder for program uh, files. And then we'll go ahead and go CD micro, uh, or MI, either one. And we'll go to the SDK folder, as so. And then CD WIN and then Windows Phone, and then CD, uh, I believe it's a V, and then we want 7.1, as I hope you're making Mango apps. And if you go ahead and press DIR, or D-I-R, you'll see different things, but right now we just want to go to Tools. So even just typing T-O or just T-O-O, -O, it should go there with Tab. And now we could just type CDX, uh, and... Uh, uh, actually, I'm sorry. Uh, we want to do CDWP, pardon me, uh, and get in there. And then you do CDX, and then in this case, 64-bit. And then simply just type W, and then tab, and then now you see WPC Connect, uh, or WP Connect, Windows Phone Connect. So, go ahead and press Enter. And my device has been established. This is perfect. So now we can go ahead and close that. So now we're back in the application deployment window. So we can go ahead and press deploy. Uh-oh, what's that? Failed to connect. Well, that's because I have my phone locked and purposely. So that if you did have this issue, we're going to resolve it. So go ahead and unlock your phone. And then go ahead and press deploy, right? Give it a moment. Now, IT Guy for Windows Phone 7 Mango is now on my device. Now, ultimately, you can also do this on the Windows Phone emulator, but uh, we're not going to do that. And also, I can't stress enough that this can be done in Visual Studio, but I'm trying to do things out of the box with you. Um, but either way, I hope this tutorial was helpful, or nonetheless, it was interesting. Thank you for watching the Tech Me Show.